Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add a custom group to the Microsoft Office ribbon. So if you don't know, this is the ribbon right here which has all of your uh, tabs and all of your icons for your various tools. And within each tab you have groups. So the home tab has a clipboard group, font group, paragraph group, and so on. And within each group are icons and tools related to that group. So the font group has things like changing the font and changing the, you know, making it bold and italic size and that kind of thing. And also within each group you have these little down arrows which bring up additional options. So Word, for example, which is what I'm in, has some default groups. And let's say you wanted to add your own custom group with some uh, specific tools that you like to use all the time. So that's easy to do. So all you have to do is go to the File tab and then to Options. And then you want to go to Customize Ribbon. And this will show all of your tabs. So you can see you have the Home tab, Insert tab, Draw tab, which match the top here. And then, like I said, here's the Home tab and here's the groups within the tab, like we just saw. Clipboard, font, paragraph, and so on. So what we want to do is go down here. So first thing you need to do is make sure you're on the tab that you want to add the group to. So I'm going to add a new tab to sorry new group to my home tab so I'm going to make sure I'm on home and click on the new group button and so by default it just calls it new group so we're gonna rename it and let's call it mailings because we're gonna do something with me mail there and you could pick an icon here I usually just leave it alone okay so now we have our, our mailings group so within that now we need to add our commands so there's a commands list it's set to popular commands by default so you could set it to uh, all commands if you just want to see everything and so we're going to go down to email okay so we're going to put in an email option so we click on add and then we will do email as PDF and that's, that's good. We'll just add those two. And so we click on OK. And now we go back and we can see we have in our home tab a new group called mailings and it has these two commands which I just added. So it's pretty simple to do. So like I said, go to File, Options, Customize Ribbon, pick the tab that you want to add a new group to, and then New Group, rename it and then add your commands click OK and you're done and if you don't want it anymore you could go back to it and click on remove and OK and then it's gone simple as that alright thanks for watching